Mm. Okay. Um, whew. So, um, what's what gives? Uh, this reading about someone, Lil Blunt, <laughs> Lil Pee Pee Blunt. Um, <laughs> I was just reading about how they said that they are so depressed that they haven't showered in six days, went to go do laundry, and the guy was smoking a weird pipe, said the machines were full. Hmm. Well, that is. Hey, look, if you're feeling spirit. feeling down, hopefully we will bump you up tonight, you know? Yeah. Hopefully. Oh, you, you chopped out. I don't know what you said. Just oh, no. Really? No, no, no. You're good now. Ah oh, shoot! I just why? don't know why. Is something I don't on? know. I don't know. Well, I don't know what you said, but I said we'll bump you up. You know, we'll boost you. We'll give you a boost tonight. I think that sounds good. Okay, so um, I don't know anything to report, Laura. Hmm. Nope. <laughs> you know what? I have this student who um, I'm always like. In the beginning of our lessons, I always say, so, anything new to report? And I have this one student who, without fail, every single time, nope. <laughs> I'm just like, guys, did you do anything fun this weekend? No. <laughs> How old is this she student? She just always says no to like conversation. It's like, okay, let's just jump into the lesson, I guess. How old are they? They're like 13. But they've always been like that. Like, even when they just starred in their own musical on you know, in their school or something. Really? Like yeah. Like, I'll be like, anything new to report? No. Were you, uh, did you have your play this weekend? Oh, yeah. How was it? It was good. <laughs> it's just, right. It's, it's what do you do with that? What do How you do you, do you get, I know it's interesting. There's sometimes it's hard to get into conversations with some people. They just don't really They talk. don't want to talk. They don't talk, you know? <laughs> no. Um, and, uh, you know, oh, we got to give a boost over to Cammie as well, who... Looks like tore her, tore her rotator cuff. What is a rot rotator cuff? Do you know what that is? I do. I not. mean, it sounds like something on your in your body of, of sorts, right? It sounds like a car part of sorts. Is a rotating cuff? Or this? it sounds like oh, maybe a it's, clothing it's part. Maybe it's this. This you rotate your hand like this, and you have the cuff right there. Oh, it's a cuff. So maybe mm -hmm. maybe it's like that. Mm -hmm. I bet that that's what that is, right? Or maybe oh shoulder. You rotate your shoulder. Okay, but could it be a cuff I'm around thinking, the ankle? But, then why what, what they call these cuff links because the cuff is right here i think right that's a cuff there's also a cuff on the ankle have yeah. you have you never cuffed your jeans hell no you haven't <laughs> <laughs> what if what if you got cuff links for your pants that imagine cuff could, links for your uh, pants you know that could be a new look i could see that becoming a thing um now anyway all right we got a good we're going to give a big boost to cam cammy we're going to give a big boost to uh, you know, a little pee pee blunt or whatever. Oh, Chode <laughs> says that they tore the crotch out of their pants, bonered too hard. That made me think to myself, what if there was a body part called the crotch link? <laughs> crotch link. <laughs> I tore my crotch link and I'm really in pain. <laughs> what would that entail? Well, it's almost like a hernia. But it's not, that's not called a crotch link, though. Uh huh. What about crotch links? I mean, the word cuff, it does not sound very medical. If you know Imagine I mean. it getting doesn't sound medical grade. So if you can have a technical term be cuff link or cuff whatever rotator, couldn't there be a crotch rote as a medical term? Yeah, and also Matt, look at that. Like Tito, you son of a bitch, you make me cuff. <laughs> you make me cuff. <laughs> so was my did I go out just now? No, so okay. then, did I? No, but I kind of feel like I'm gonna be getting chopped up in a little bit. But anyway, um, but I was thinking crotch links could be kind of like cuff links, but they're for your crotch. You know, they're like a little stud that you put on the well, crotch. They're studs or? that studs that you kind of use to, I guess, button your pants. Button up. Of, they're kind of, you know, it's like a button fly, but with little, you studs. know, um, studs. Yeah. <laughs> You could so, have different ones. Like you could have a four leaf clover. You could have the dude from Lucky Charms, for all I know. I don't know. You could have all of it. Different who? types of charms. What's oh, the little, oh. what's the leprechaun guy's name from Lucky Charms? Is his name Lucky? 
<laughs> I didn't know he had a name at all. I thought he might. <laughs> really lucky? Well, I don't know. I'm just guessing here. Mm. What if his name was Link? And he's like, I've got new shapes. They're entitled the Crotch Link shape or something like that. <laughs> like, you know how they always new shapes? <laughs> right, right, right. There was horseshoes, diamonds, hearts, and crotch links. What was the, there was a, I remember they premiered a new shape and it was a big deal, you know? Rainbows, perhaps? Clouds? Or diamond, no, diamonds have always been there. Um, I think the rainbow was a new, like, addition. Maybe the purple time. horseshoe was actually a new thing. That was the purple new charm. Purple horseshoe, maybe. indeed. Yes, it was. <laughs> so, okay, you're in pain, Cammy. I'm going to do one thing and then we'll get the show started already because we're kind of a little late here. Let me boost her. This is how I'm going to get rid of Cammy's pain. You get you ready, Laura? You know how to do this. We're going to join in. You know how to do get rid of pain, right? Pretty darn sure I do. Okay, here we go. Shango. Is that what you're going to do? Shango. Take the pain hey. away. I did that on Ethan the other day and it worked, but I didn't say Shango. Well, oh, really? No, I did a different one that someone did on me when I was a kid, and it seemed to work. Or no, I think it didn't work on me, but it worked on the twins. You just go like, this. You go like this. Oh, that's a pap. It's really the Karate Kid stuff. White light, white light, white light, white oh. light. And then it just goes away, and supposedly it worked. They All right, how that. about this? Shh, okay, let me. this is for Cammy. Here we go. And you know what? This is also for the emotional pain or whatever that you know, little pee pee blunt might be experiencing too. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, batala, shango, take the pain away. I think it worked. Okay. Okay. If well, that I hope doesn't work, I don't know what will. <laughs> That's pretty much the only way to get rid of pain. You just got to use the powers of Shango and Obatala. You know? I'm pretty sure that's the only way to make it work. I'm pretty sure that's Fuck the that only Tylenol. way. Fuck that Tylenol ass shit. It's all about Shango. You know, by the way, I've got pain right now in my shoulder uh, or up here in my back kind of shoulder area. I don't know what's going on. Pain I need don't to get some me. Shango. Can, Laura, can you put some Shango on my shoulder? <laughs> Shango, Shango, take the pain away. Take the pain Gotta away. Take the pain away. Anyway, I'm gonna do that. I would say that I had pain in my shoulder, but thing is, is pain don't hurt to me. <laughs> now what's that? And for a hundred points, who knows what that's from? But you know, I, I know it's. I just Does anybody here, here know? Do you know? I, yes, I do. It's from Roadhouse. Oh, man, you gave it away, damn it. Well, you asked me. You asked me just no, now. No, but I mean, I wanted you to just say if you knew. And not the uh, I, I see, I see. Well, you know, we we kind of went over this in a previous episode. Okay, you know? okay. Um, did we show a clip? Did we show a clip? Well, we did indeed, yes. Yeah. Wow, isn't that a good clip? Hold on a second. Did somebody get it? Oh, Sh Shango and Paint. Oh, Shango and Paint. Um, uh, <laughs> Thank you well, so much, sir, for the mana treat for sending that money to us to... <laughs> Give those good vibes to, to Cammy because yeah. that would that helps. You're not Anybody the only one. Bryce wanted, did it too. Bryce, Bryce did it that too. really helps. He boosted Cammy too. <laughs> <laughs> he boosted he boosted Cammy via us too. You know that um, and Shango are the only ways to get right, rid of. I'm, I will address the jacket. I just I like to just be bundled up. You know what I mean? I like being bundled up. I don't. I turned the heater off just because I felt like I don't. It I ha, it was got a little too hot, and then now it's kind of. I know it's going to get colder and I just, I'm just getting prepared. I like to be bundled up is all, you know? Uh -huh. look, I mean, look, can't you see that it's snowing outside? Look at, look at the, the window. <laughs> anyway. Um, okay. Let's, let's start the show. How about it? Huh? Now that Shango, now that Shango's here and Obatala. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay. Am I getting cut? Welcome to the Chicken Coop. My name is Brent Weinbach. I'm Laura Weinbach. And um, this is the chat show, and we, you know, do different things. We usually just check things out, and we kind of analyze things, break things down. We boost people. We summon Shango and Obatala. And we save Cami. 
And we that's right. Tammy the telethon in which you can <laughs> dial in just like Kimball Whiting did. Or look at this, what Peace P- South did. Oh, Peace South. South doing a that's, damn for, thing. that's for Lil PP right there. You know? <laughs> Lil PP open her. Um, that pain. Take so, the pain away. We're taking that pain away. So we're, that's what we're all about, really, was we break things down, we take pains away, or we try to, at least. And so um, we're going to do, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to, you know, we sometimes we look at commercials, sometimes we look at, I don't know, other things, pictures and things, and I don't know, song lyrics we sometimes rewrite or analyze, and oh, lots of them. Sometimes we just chat, you know, we just chat, and we talk about the good old days. The Reagan years. We talk about the Reagan years, the good old days. Talk about the reggae years as well. The reggae years too, yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, Those were not my good years, let me tell you. <laughs> I, You know, it's kind of funny that, you know, Chick and Jessica, you and I are kind yeah. of in some ways benefiting from other people's pain right now. <laughs> Chick and Jessica, don't, or, well, I might stand to benefit as well, to be honest. I... <laughs> What do you mean? Look I at, said I said Chicken Jessica, you and I. Who's Chicken Jessica? Not me. Wait, do you not know who Chicken Jessica is? This I point? do know who Chicken Jessica is, but why are you saying Chicken Jessica, you and I? Wait, what? Chicken Jessica, <laughs> you and I are. Yeah, oh, like Chicken show, Jessica, the, sh- comma, the show, the show, you, me, Laura, and you. Yeah. I thought you were saying you were like saying Chicken Jessica. You and I, like to Chicken Jessica, <laughs> like as if you thought I was like accidentally calling me Chicken. Yeah, just, mind. just for the record, sorry to pop in. I was also yeah. confused. CJ, yeah, you're dead to me. <laughs> I'm yeah. just kidding. That just is so weird joke. to me. That is so weird to me. That is interesting that you it's guys. It's not didn't, weird. Didn't, you didn't know what I was talking about when I said I thought you were Chicken talking Jessica. You and I. Jessica. I'm calling. You mean you said uh, Chicken like, Jessica? Like it's, it's, you and if I, I were to say Brent, you and I. Stand to benefit from. I said, Chicken Jessica, you and I. That didn't seem like what you were saying. (laughs) It was what you were saying, exactly what you were saying, but it didn't read as such. Well, whatever. I don't know. It's fine. It all worked out. It all worked out. And you know what? It's going to keep working out as long as you people keep the telethon alive (laughs) with your contributions because pain is no joke. It's no joke. (laughs) But it ain't no thing to her. But it don't pain don't hurt to me but for other yeah. people such as chicken jessica and brent and of course cammy it's a thing well how about this why don't we get into today's segment yeah oh 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 but first but oh, first but can first? i hop in oh, here but, again oh, oh but first oh but first i want to tell the people about the super chat is it okay Oh, you don't know what the super chat is, actually. What is that? What? And- well, you may have noticed, like, um, <clears throat> a lot of people showing their support for Cammy, but it's really support for us right here. <laughs> um, you know, right there. Uh-huh. Wow, ten bucks from T South. Um, so that's a super chat, and uh, the way you do that is you click on the dollar sign in the uh, the chat window. Just watch this. Oh, you did. <laughs> you click on the dollar sign on the chat window. Pick a super sticker, super chat. I think super chats are better, but whatever. Then you, you drive up that dollar amount, you hit buy and send. As you can see, my message there says type message here. And um, that, whatever, that's how you do the super chat. Oh, that's pretty good. There you go. <laughs> I was just look, reading, looking at this comment right here. This is pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. My back hurts right now. I lifted, no, also a, I lifted a TV. You need some boosted chicken, Jessica, you and I, myself. <laughs> <laughs> that somehow makes more sense than what happened earlier. Yeah, right anyway, okay. and here's Josiah with the. With the oh, okay, the good. Chat. Oh, wow, good. Very good. Can That's we helping. Really quickly boost. highlight yeah. Peace Out's comment that says, I took it the way Laura took it because I, yeah, just for the record. Wow. This, you know what's this. funny? I just realized Peace South sounds like Peace Out in a way, you know? Oh, yeah. All right. All right, Matt. All right, man. I'm going to boost you up. I'm going to boost you up later. All right, then. I'm going to boost you up with 10. Right? I'm going to boost you up with the 10 spot. All right, Matt. Peace out. Peace out. <laughs> anyway. Right. All right. I think my internet seems unstable or something, right? Could be. You are chopping. You're chopping. 
He doesn't Shoot. seem to be You're chopping Chopin, in either. Chopin mm-hmm. broccoli over there. Yeah. I'm chopping chop, broccoli chop, over here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, oh my God. Everybody's in pain right now. Jeez. Wow. This is no joke. We got to call upon the powers of Super Chats and Shango to correct these issues. Um, okay. Look. Let's get Ultra 1000. Let's give a quick boost. Let's call on the powers of Shango real quick for, uh, uh, you know, for this this guy. And yeah, okay, Gemma. here we go. Who? Gemma. Gemma, too? Gemma Leslie. Why? Do they got she a had, problem, too? She had to help Ultra. Oh, okay. Well, everybody is. Okay. Oh, okay. Right. Here we go. Let's put, let's put. Shango, take Ultra 1000's pain away. Away. All right. Hopefully that did something. I don't know. <laughs> but um, let's let's talk about today's topic. Okay. Look, this is what it is. All right. And thank you, Chicken Jessica, for explaining how to you know support all these people in pain right now. Um, you know, by uh, boosting boosting them through us. You boost us. You boost them. It's boost a, us. You boost them. That's how it works. Them. Yeah, if we don't, if we're not boosted, you're not boosted. If we're not Vidal, boosted, they are not boosted. Vidal Sassoon. If we're not boosted, you and I are not boosted, and they're not boosted. <laughs> Never mind. Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> no, if we're not, if we're not, if you're not boosted, Chicken Jessica, you and I, myself, <laughs> we and them are not boosted. As but well. they are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they are. They are. Um, but them aren't. <laughs> them aren't. <laughs> so anyway. Uh, Here's how we're uh, going to do this. Okay? We got a new member up in oh, here. Shoot, Trout, new, welcome oh, to the club. Shoot, we got a new member welcome up here. That means, damn, we got to boost it. We got to oh, boost it up hard. We got to boost it up hard for Trout, oh, though. On the God, on the Trout. after show debriefs, you're going to see Trout. It's come, Trout, we're gonna get Trout some, we ain't seen nothing yet. Pain Trout is me. out. And by out, I mean in. You are going to be coming in hard when we do the after show debriefs. Trout is about to be in, not out. Oh, that's it. That's the rhyme right there. So don't mess with these booths because you're going to be a Boy Scout. <laughs> oh, that's good, Laura. That's pretty Isn't good. Uh, yeah, pretty good. You're a natural yeah, rapper. You're such a rapper. Jeez. Yeah. All right. Now let's do this. You know, last week we did, we had our Martin Luther. Oh, New member, God. Mackenzie MC oh, wait. Isawa. MC I think it's MC Isawa. Oh, MC Isawa. Really, that sounds like a rap name, actually. That sounds like a real rap name, actually. Wow. Okay, we got to go big. We're gonna go we big for go Trout. On, we got to go full boost on these mo's. We're going full boost on <laughs> Mick, <laughs> MC MC Iwaza, or Izawa, Izawa, and, and Trout. It doesn't seem like it said Mick. We you know, need to Mick, go full Trout on MC Izawa tonight. <laughs> we're going full Trout on all these people, and we're gonna do that in the after show debris, which we'll talk about near the end of the show. Okay, but we're gonna get you hard in there. Okay, guys. <laughs> one, one, one. Can we're happen. gonna be making you guys real hard tonight. Oh, God. Doesn't matter what your your uh, your body looks like. We're Shango's making Shango's gonna boost y'all up. Oh yeah, Obatala. Obatala up in this PS. Obatala up there. Yeah, I'm gonna up in yeah, this okay. PS. Okay, so anyway, here we go. So <clears throat> we're gonna go big on those people, those two, aren't we? And then the rest of the gang, the regulars, we're gonna go big, aren't we? We're gonna go hard on them. One right? can hope. One can hope. Yes. Yeah, full full blown Gunia style. Very good, Tommy full Maserati. Gunia style up in here. <laughs> up in here. All right. Let's get All this right. going. So now. look, you know, last week we did our um Martin Luther King episode, which was about dreams, right? Um, and those dreams being <laughs> dreams in the same way that you know movies are described as dreams, but movies that you can control are video games, basically, right? So we were looking at a lot of video game commercials and stuff as a sort of homage to uh, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. But today we thought, well, you know, why don't we kind of stick with that in that realm, you know, stay in that realm a little bit. And why don't we, we thought well, maybe we should take a look at some um, box art, you know, just art. I guess this is the art episode in a way, but box art for these different games. And we have a whole bunch of games and we're just going to go through a bunch of them. I mean, if one of them catches our eye, we might spend some more time on it. And if another one 
the, you know, if, a lot of them I'd imagine are, we're going to just speed through. We're just going to be going to go next, next. That's what I I'm actually um, just had a thought and this is a little bit of a crazy idea, but, uh -huh. and we don't have to do it, but what about if we throw in some box art for things in addition to video games, like cereal boxes or other well, fun stuff such as that? It could just be completely off the cuff. Well, I think Chicken Jessica sort of has things that are already prepared right well, now. I know she does. I know she does, but like we could also just kind of throw that wrench in if one wanted to, just to call upon the powers of Obatula and Shango. You know what? I think so that could be a different episode. In fact, all right, fine, <laughs> or or whatever, or I don't know. I mean, you know, I mean, <laughs> the hard no is what that sounds like. No, that's... it's not a hard no. It's just I that, that you know, Chicken Jessica has. Uh, you know, Chicken Jessica has sort of things kind of set out and ready no, to I go. No, I know. That's why I figured it was a bit of a wild idea <laughs> and that it was not going to fly, but that's okay. One so, minute. okay, look. So this is an, uh, this segment is called, it's called, um, Bach, it's called Bach Chartres. Does anybody even understand that title? <laughs> Anyone? That 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 title screen? Right, can somebody get it? break down what this title? Yeah, is? yeah. We want to see how people did we break get to it that? down. How do we yeah, how get, do we to, get that? to? How do we get to this? Title. Break can it down. Yes. <laughs> okay. Weird okay, artifacts has well, it. Yeah. Okay. Weird artifacts. That's a good. Josiah. Guess. Josiah has it too. Just so you know. No, but then how did we get to Jean Paul Chart? How do we Wait. get to Jean Paul Chart? How did we get to Jean Paul Chart? No, Jean... <laughs> how did Jean Paul Sartre get into the mix? Jean Paul Sartre. How did we arrive Sartre. at that? Yeah, how we get that? <laughs> uh, I mean, okay. look, E and B, E and B I gets it. They, they get e &B it. Sort of does, but not exactly. They get no, it. Didn't, it's, no, he didn't say. They no, all get it. it. No, I don't know. They all get it. It's over. It's over. They no, no. Ian B, Ian B is just referencing Jean Paul Sartre work, but like, does Jean Paul? I mean, how do we arrive at Jean Paul Sartre? I mean, it's pretty obvious. Is it though? <laughs> yeah. It's box art. They know. They get it. No one said that. Not a single. They person. did. They did. They no. said you're reviewing box art. No, they said we're reviewing box art. Oh, but I mean, they get that. That it sounds like box art. Well, they don't. B a w k s h a. -R -T. Actually, I would say this: the one part of this that people aren't really spelling out. Is, Nobody seemed to get it. <laughs> no, is the scatological element of it all? Yeah. You know? Well, no, I think they got that. That's obvious. I don't know if they even got that necessarily because did they oh, notice that so the themes? Obvious. Did they notice that the theme to it, the theme song jingle was? I'm pretty sure know. they noticed that. Well, it's not actually. This is actually Chicken Jessica kind of took us some initiative here, but Cho said to, I understand sharding too well. There you go. Okay, right, but so it's but the the jingle seemed to be something of a wet fart of sorts, right? Sharp. What I didn't realize is it did also kind of sound militaristic in a way, you know, and um, it did seem like maybe that was, um, you know, and then Chicken Jessica kind of added that kind of in there a little bit, I think, right? Uh, the militant aspect? Yeah, the military aspect. And then also someone said, M Josiah said MSG. Is that some Wait, sort of... Wait, why is there a military aspect? Wait, was it MSG? Did it's, you say? No, it's, mono, it's, mono, it's, mono, met, met, oh, let me try to guess. Let me try to guess. Okay, it's some right. kind of modern game or something like that, probably. Um, let me just th think. It's, don't, don't even. I, I got it. it MSG, mo monosodium glutamate. Late night talk show said they woke to a shark the other day. Oh my god! <laughs> I woke to I woke to it to a shark the other day. Real bummer. That is outrageous. Oh, um, Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid is what that is. All right, I guess. I don't think anybody got it, to be honest. Oh, but Metal Gear Solid isn't solid as in poo, right? It's a solid versus a liquid. All right. They should call it Metal Gear Liquid, actually. That's what they should call it, right? They should just call it Metal Gear Shart. <laughs> <laughs> what if they called it Metal, you know, Metal, Metal of Honor Gear. 
colon. Brown shit. brown art. What is that? Wait, what if ops? they called it Metal Gear colon C O L O N shart? <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. No. Wait. What What is the game that has Black Ops? Because I'm thinking Brown Ops. <laughs> you know, know what I mean. I Anyways, know let's do it. Let's okay. let's load up. What? Okay. Let's go look at the first box. We're just going to skim through a bunch of these. You know, We'll just see how it goes. So, okay, 3D World Runner. Anything to say about that? Okay, I see what appears to be something in the vein of a scorpion combined with a cockroach. Can we zoom Flying in on that? Ass? towards a running man of sorts wearing what appear to be some <laughs> rain boots. Very <laughs> thick. They're these actually thick gold rain boot. Look at these you know soles on his boots. Look at his butt. His butt area is kind of bulbous. look at his bum right now. But right. also, go it's to his just, boots. There's no can crack. You, wait, can you go to his boots real quick? Those are just galoshes. They are. I mean, those but are look not at the soles. They're very rugged on the bottom. Well, what's though. interesting is those are almost like seventies. I mean, they don't. It doesn't seem like they're really gonna support you that well when you're running or something like that. You know. Well, they look a bit intensive on the sole, I have to say. No, look at that leg. What, what is going on that, in the leg? Can you go in, wait, can you zoom in on the leg there? I'm, I'm just really rather curious. Oh, I about... think, look at it. They actually decided to sort of um, enhance the muscular sort of ridges of his thigh. It's, I, that Even almost doesn't look like a... Not skin tight. Yeah, I guess, it, yeah, it's that's weird. interesting. They made it skin tight on that area, but... Right, but then it's yeah, ruffled on the bottom. There's a feminine ruffle on the bottom. <laughs> There's sort of a feminine ruffle a on the feminine bottom. Ruffle, feminine muscle. It's almost, imagine feminine actually that ruffle it, meets a masculine muscle. Well, imagine his pants were like that. Imagine he was not wearing boots, and Dude. then and that the pants ended where those rough where it looks like right. they end What's right there. The yeah, What's just imagine pants. Imagine pants that are like that, where they're skin tight on the thigh, but then at the knee part they just ruffle out, and that's it. And then what they if they open just up. called it? What if they just called it? Muff, ruffled mu muscle, ruffle muscle. Or how about 3D World Ruffer? Wait, go back 3D to the title. World Ruffle. Yeah, I don't know. Go back to the title. 3D World Ruffle. Zoom out. Yeah. Let's hold the that. 3D World Ruffle. Right. Now zoom in on this creature here. Wait, wait. Yeah. Look at this sort of penile sort of thing sticking out of his chest. That's a bit sort of suggestive, isn't it? It actually looks like. Uh, I know it's. It looks like a chest hair. Go. Actually, sorry. Can you go back? Actually, to the. That wait, looks go, like a sort of. Um, go go back to the man here. Well, his chest. That looks like his chest hair is sort of just blooming. You know, right now or something like that. Spr it sprouted out. <laughs> he got a bit and of it's a sprout. trailing. It's like a trailed. It does also, suggest a certain sort of penile implant, doesn't it? You know why this is called 3D World Runner? Is because he wears 3D glasses. Really? Well, look, it looks like he's wearing 3D glasses. Oh, right. All right, I'm sorry. Wait. Can we go back? Oh, wait, can you go to his glove real quick? Wow. He's almost sticking up his middle finger. Oh, or... No, that's his forefinger. Oh, I guess it is, yeah. His glove is ruffled as well to a degree, isn't it? It is. Well, it's kind of got a... Um... It has one of those neck things, you know. It's almost got a sort of yeah, a, um, neck ruffle. a, a sort of a rococo. A renaissance. Kind of, it's not rococo. It's, got, it's renaissance. Is what it's sort of a baroque kind of style collar it's one of to those, it. Like, you know, Queen Elizabeth ruffle type of look. It's something like that. Yeah, I guess it's some sort mm -hmm. of renaissance. I guess he's a bit of a renaissance man. Well, he's a neo renaissance ruffler. <laughs> he's a yeah exactly. <laughs> He's a, a world neo... ruffler. Yeah, he's a 3D it's a, it's a, world ruffler. He's the 3D world ruffler. They with... they definitely should change the name of this game to Ruffled Muscle. <laughs> In galoshes. But the galoshes are more like sort of self-explanatory. <laughs> okay. Well, let's go to the creature real quick one more time real quick. Ruffle Muscle. What if it was called Ruffle Muscle? What would the game entail? Well, it'd probably be the same kind of thing, but they just it's a guy kind of running around in galoshes. Is that an alien or is that a scorpion combined with sort of some sort it of kind of looks like right. some sort of uh, STD. Look at his tongue. The tongue is a bit sort of insectual. <laughs> There's insectual. something kind of scorpion like about his tongue. Sex you know? Insectuous. It actually looks like a scorpion. His tongue looks like a scorpion. Well, his tail, his body looks like a scorpion. His tongue is also scorpion-like, but it's also kind of lizard-like or something. 
Oh, his legs are cockroach like. No, his body is like a scorpion in a way. Yeah, it's that's almost, what I was saying. The tongue is almost a sort of miniature of his body or, in a way. Right. Yeah. But coming out the other way. You're right. Anyway, it's a mirror of it. By the way, we can move on to it. There's so Let's many. Move on. We have so many. There's so there's many not, that we can... we're really digging on this one. Yeah. Well, okay, real quick. <laughs> Let's look at this eight eyes here. What's eight going eyes. on? Eight eyes. Eight, 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 eight eyes. eyes. Eight eyes. Oh, look eight at those. Eight look eyes. At... <laughs> eight eyes. Eight eyes. Right, right, right. Every morning, my rectum. Um, wait, look at there's there's jewels inside those holes there. Right, jewels. That rem that's reminiscent of the movie Barbarian, isn't it? Oh, you mean having the jewel in that girl's belly button? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it is, right, Eight Eyes is the uh, is basically a, a a hardcore bully who's double the size of a normal bully. He goes, "Yeah, shut up, Eight Eyes. Yeah, whatever, Eight Eyes." Or maybe it's actually like a reference to, oh my God, that is so funny. Wow. It's like his crotch is right there and there's nothing on it, but there's something in the dark there that we're not seeing. Yeah, go on. Go deep into wow. the dark there. I know. What is up with It'd be funny if you went really close to the dark and you could see a penis or something. That would be well, pretty good. Well, it's really right? suggestive that there's some kind of penis in there. It's I interesting that they kind of leave this to the imagination. Yeah. But they don't. There's some, there's some lumps and ridges in there. What happened to his penis is the question. And then kind of look at his face real quick. Can I get, let me see those teeth. It wow, seems as though he he's has, not. Look at his nose. He's look, got like. Can you go crinkle. zoom in really hardcore on that? He's got a bit of a crinkle in his nose there. I mean, a crinkle in his. I know he's. He's kind of crinkling, but it seems like he's almost saying cheese, though, in a way for the camera. You know, wait, saying... let's just conceptual. Let, let's just consider what actually is in the dark shadow of his loin area, because is he wearing some sort of thong or underwear or is it just bare? And it, does it have pubic hair or not? Did he shave it? <laughs> does it smell? <laughs> I mean, seriously, what would be there? What would be there? In real, like, if he was wearing that outfit, what do you think he'd be wearing under there? A thong? Or just, like, a sort of, you know, I regular under be, underpants? I think he'd be wearing sort of a, a, a strapped cup. A scrapped cup? No, a strapped cup. A you know? strapped cup. Yeah. Do you feel that his... Do you think that he feels at all vulnerable that his nards might get hit? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what... Maybe or is he be. feeling like, oh, yeah, I'm totally fine because I've got a cup on and I'm pretty much invisible. And do the, does the eight eye idea kind of refer to like a butthole and a penis hole that we're not seeing? So right. Don't they call two, something a... Three, four, five, six, seven, and then a butthole. Oh, orifices. <laughs> that's what they all are. Right. So Because they, they, don't they say something about someone's eye or... Do they call someone's butthole a brown eye or something like that? They absolutely do, yes. Okay, so let's just think about how many orifices there, or eyes, so to speak, there are. So there's two eyes, two ears, holes, the penis, the butthole, no, the, holy goat, hole, the holy hole. ghost. Oh, the two nose holes, shoot. That's yeah, they left eight. off the ninth eye. <laughs> right, which is? The penis hole. No, I said that. No, but that's what I think. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Oh, five there, and yeah. Then yeah. And then well no, we could say this. How about they left off how about they left off the the mouth so that we can get the penis in there? Well, I'd love that. <laughs> let's yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> I think it should be called one, two, three, four, five, hold on. Six, seven, and then is the belly button a hole? No. You sure? Technically is not a hole, right? Okay. Man, so, seriously, what is going on in his wait, crotchal area? Am I missing something? I here? can't believe how intense that is. Look at his I mean, he's just his actually red white eagle. Do eyes even count as orifices? I guess they do. Um, so that we need nine eyes, actually. Yes. Yeah, so they should be calling it nine eyes. I guess eyes, well, I mean, right. Eyes are an eyes. <laughs> they are eyes. Uh yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's called nine eyes, right? Or eight eyes, not nine um, eyes. Anything else you want to see about this? I mean, I am just a bit shocked at this sort of his whole legs being spread so widely open. And then <laughs> the area that would normally be. Um, it's almost like it got censored. Just censored. Yeah, it's just it's almost like it was censored or something. Yeah. 
You want to look at the guy what who's would be there? What? Would... I mean, wait, look at this guy's hand right here. Go down. Look at his hand, though. Right. Huh? There's something about that hand. What do you think about that hand? It, it almost say... looks like a fallen man. The hand. Look at. Wait. Look at that front hand, though, real quick. You know, it looks like two legs and and the arms on the sides, and he's well, kind of fallen over. You know what I mean? Hands do like. have the ability to look like that. look like men, yeah, yeah, like fallen men. Mm -hmm. But uh, okay, you can zoom out. Um, how about the it's, limp. it's both limp and firm at the same time? That hand, right? It's sort of it looks sort like of, it, it looks was tense. pinching something. No, it looks sort of tense and sort of rigid, but then it has fallen. So. The rigidness sort of stuck around, but at the same time, it's limp because it's a dad. Gemma says that that helmet is a breast. Oh, yeah, it could be. They said that helmet is 100% a tit. Uh-huh. Yeah, it does look like that. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> look a... at the skeleton's, uh, like, crotchal area. Right, right. It's purple. What, well, look at this. Let's look at the foreground guy I real quick. What? Let's just look at the foreground guy, if possible, here. We'll look at his face. In what okay. era did any oh, warrior ever wow. wear an outfit that revealing? Look at look at these guys in the back, by the way. That's the Celtics, maybe? Wow, there's actually a lot of detail here that I, yeah. I'm just... I there's all that. these guys in the background and stuff, you know? know all these they're... different bad guys. Oh, there's even more guys back there. Wow, let's zoom in on those guys real quick. Let's take a look. Yeah, that guy's got a ponytail. Who? The guy on the right. Oh no, that's his helm. Helms used no, to no, have I ponytails think, back in those no, days. No, I think he's more of a monk or something, and he's got a ponytail. You know. I don't know, man. All right, let's go the to the next one. Helmets had ponytails. Trust me, it's a thing. What? No, helmets I know that. had ponytails, especially during that. Like, the Romans and stuff. I know that. I know that. But they also I'm had mohawks on them too. I think he was a different kind of guy, though. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Next. Oh yeah. If you Are they just Russian? so you know, uh, Chick and Jessica, if you if you start messing with the picture, you can't use the arrows to get back. You're gonna have to put the, the thank you back. Thank you. Right. <laughs> so you have wait. To, it's still uh, not going. How do I? <laughs> you, do you got. You want to go to the back to the thumbnails to so show the thumbnails again. Oh, the sidebar. And then yeah, sidebar gotcha. and then. Then you can start getting back on that tip, you know. Well, I'm unchecking hide sidebar, but it's hey, oh, Justin, thumbnails. By the way, Justin's got it right. Brent's thinking a Goro type figure. <laughs> I'm also thinking of Sasaki or whatever the character's name is from the Gomon series. Hang on, my preview crashed. So I gotta open it again. Hold on. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. So anyway, Laura, what are you thinking of this segment so far? <laughs> It is what it is. <laughs> okay. It's fine. It's fine, I guess. I don't know. It's a bit of a dig. It's a bit of an excavation. Well, no, it's fine. What do you think? It's a bit of a dig, huh? Mm, sorry, Trout. <laughs> I mean, nah, mean, well, Trout is just a joining member. We need to really get, go full strong on this one. Well, <laughs> just wait till we go full strong on... You know, Full stuff. well, look, if we see, look, we'll look at stuff. We'll, we just have to, um, we just, we're going to, we, you know, we can say next if we want to, you know what I mean? We, we can go next. Okay. Anything to say about, okay, hold on real quick. Just zoom in on those guys. Well, those guys in the back are a bit. Wait, this is all a bit zoomed out, isn't it? <clears throat> are well, those okay. guys like, they're not, their backs are to the guy. So they're like it almost okay. I, I just have to acknowledge this that they're the heads look like piles of poo, red poo, so bloody poo, and those guys look like they're squatting as if just you could easily and don't worry about doing this, chicken Jessica, but you could just cut out the tops of the them and put that on underneath them, and you would get what looked like a poo, bloody poos. Maybe I think it looks almost like and they do look like Devo as well. Censoring yeah. both their breasts and their eyes, like it looks like they're not wearing any shirts and they're just wearing pants with suspenders on them and that there's these blue lines that are that are like censoring the breast area and the face area see what i'm saying oh yeah 
Oh, yeah. See oh, how right. their arms are like oh, naked? Right. And then right. it's like, those are just these blue lines that are going over the breastal area. <laughs> the breastal area. Let's go to the next one. Mm-hmm. Let's zoom in on this a little bit, you know, so that it's just bigger. Okay. Um, wow. All right. That's that. We can go next on that unless you want to talk about it a little bit. I don't. Have Wait, hold on. Say. The yeah. arcade's ultimate aerial experience comes home. Okay. Cool. You, 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 can you keep it so things are zoomed in one more than that kind of a thing? Because, uh, yeah, like that. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, let's go next. Oh, I get it. Yeah. Okay. I mean, not much mm-hmm. to say here. Just a, sort of a classic, uh, I guess, World War II kind of scene. <laughs> right. Kind of. Wait, hold on. Can we see the guy? Is are we able to see a man inside that co- the, the cockpit or whatever? I mean, that on that plane there on the left, the the leftmost plane. Wow, nineteen forty two. That's crazy. This game came out in nineteen forty two. No, but uh, here's what's kind of crazy though is that the other planes look like not a big deal, right? Because. There's no guys there, so you don't associate a human being with that, really. Well, is there a guy in there actually? Can it, I associate? It? I mean, there's guys. Well, no, be. no, but it's easy to shoot down a plane like this in a game when you're not really seeing the human behind it. But right there, you're seeing a human in there, and that's kind of wow, intense, actually. You know? I don't know. What about Ninja Gaiden or? No, any... I know, I I know, I know. But I'm just saying that. It's just it, come on. It just, I, I guess because this illustration is a little more you know i don't know well it's a bit uh you know realistic i just thought those were i just thought they were planes okay i just thought they were planes and now i'm looking in there and i see there's a a real man in there yeah oh yeah this is based on this is based on the spielberg movie 1942 (laughs) all right right, continue oh this one this is the sequel came out in 1943 Yeah, this one's the oh oh my gosh, that guy's gonna Whoa, get that looks like a woman, uh, like an old lady. It actually looks like a tourist who's not even part of the fight. You know, they're kind of just watching this. You know what I mean? They they it's a ride along. You know what I mean? Like a a police ride along. Wait, what is this one? Oh, nineteen forty three. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> can you go back on? Is there anyone else that can be seen inside these planes? No, it's just the one tourist that's watching this whole thing. Okay. That's interesting. Wait, okay. Just, you saw the person's face, yeah? Inside yeah. the plane? Yeah. It let, looked like an old lady. Let's go next. Oh. Okay, what's the... Okay, so, yeah. Go in more? <laughs> what? I don't know. What? It's funny. Uh... Yeah, it's pretty straight ahead. <laughs> I mean, kind of. I don't know. Okay, next. <laughs> oh, look at this. Wow. Wait, why, why are you skipping over? Oh, I see what you I don't know, it was glitching out. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. A Nightmare. I was wondering why this was an A. No, A Nightmare on Elm Street. That's what it's called, the movie. Right. He was wondering it why. Skip, I don't know. It keeps skipping. I think something's wrong with that file. Let's Maybe it doesn't want it doesn't want you to do that. I, I guess it's. I think that preview is afraid of. You know, it doesn't want to have the weird dreams or whatever. Let's look at this Abadox then. Sure. Abadox. What the heck does the deadly, that even mean? The deadly inner. It says the deadly inner war. Is this a a battle inside someone's mind? You know, is that right. is he kind That's of fighting his own like, demons or something like yeah, that? Yeah, fighting his own demons. Look at his his positioning here, this man, you know? Well, wait, hold up. He's got like a space thing, a spacecraft over his Interesting head. Interesting how green he, he's this Whoa, look at that. Green. Like That is a straight up looking like a rectum up in there. <laughs> that fire pit area. Look at that. Where? Holly. Look, down, in, down, okay. Zoom in on the fiery area on the like bottom half. Oh, yeah, bottom. it is a rectum. Oh, my God, that is a butthole straight up. And that's a worm, a tapeworm in front of it. <laughs> Right. <laughs> that person got tapeworm. 
Right. And their butthole was but, on the fire. But, oh, well, actually, that's how you get a tapeworm out. Is that was their deadly out? inner war. Their the inner tapeworm war actually, was, you're right. Yeah, the the inner war was there's a tapeworm inside of them. They had to get it out. That's what it is. They had diarrhea and it really hurt. felt like well, fire. Well, no, you know how they have to get the... Um, the uh, the tapeworm comes out of the butt. That's how you have to get no, it out. Dar. You have to lure you have to lure it out for the butthole. Dar, dar. So that was the inner war. Is the tapeworm? I guess the tapeworm's inner self looks like that, like kind of toothy guy on the upper right hand corner. Mm -hmm. Like that's the cur that's his the inner character of the tapeworm. Mm. Now what's up with this weird spacecraft hovering above the dude's head? <laughs> it's like a brain spacecraft or something like that, or like zoom in on it. Is there a person in it? As a tourist? Is there a tourist? Deadly inner war. You know what, man? I, it's weird how, I mean, you know, this cover looks mostly whimsical, but the Abadox font and or sign is so kind of graphically violent looking. You know what I mean? Right. I mean, look at everything else looks kind of cartoony and kind of still, you know, fun and sort of, yeah, whimsical, like I said. But just zoom in on that Abadox right there. It's just truly bloody right there i mean gee it's whiz so, it's definitely not like i mean nice. th i mean that it really is that's very uh that's yeah. dark it's dark yeah dark that's the word yeah next now oh, this is the classic action 52 anything in here that you want to see go well, zoom that's in just a mess <laughs> they could not decide on a look for this cover so they went with every idea that Whoa. Suggested retail two hundred dollars. That That's outrageous. crazy. That is crazy. Suggested retail two hundred dollars. So this game has fifty two games in one. So that's why they couldn't decide. You know. Oh no wonder it's a mess. You know, you could just play one game per week. And game. This game could last you a whole year. You just play one game per week. There's no color concept on this cover. It's just every random idea that they threw in here. Next, have a look. That looks fun. Yeah. Well, at least having your eye. Go next on these, I guess. Unless, so hold on. If you go back real quick to the to that last Adam Sandler loan, just zoom in on. Let's just zoom in on these actors real quick. I know we know him, Raul Julia. Raul well, we Julia. don't. We don't know him. You know? I met him. I hung out with him. Oh, you met him. We talked about him? Madonna. <laughs> yeah, right. I swear. He said, "Who do you like musically?" And I said, "I like Madonna." He's like, "I like Madonna too." Now, what about um, you know, Christina Ricci back then? I mean, that that's a good look for her. I feel like you know. I mean, I think that's yeah. But then she know. just walked away from it. And what if she kind of maintained that her whole life? That would be kind of. Do you think that was a good look for Pugsley? I like it. <laughs> hey, look! There's a man. Oh, he's sticking up his middle finger, kind of. There's a there's a an erected man. He's not fallen anymore. No longer right. fallen. Um, let's look at Pugsley's uh, face real quick. And then we'll look at Christopher Lloyd. Christopher Lloyd, go up to Christopher Lloyd's face. Up, he's <laughs> thinking like he's going. Say what? He's like, what you talk about? What you talk no, about? I think he's about? like, he's like, oh, I totally just farted. <laughs> <laughs> that is the face of a man who just woke up to a shard, as they say, <laughs> or something to that effect. All right, next. He looks. Yeah, he like does look kind of funny. In that something's picture. up going on in his pants area. This looks pretty classic. This is like some. Whoa! What is the background? Like... Is that like a weird bird type of person? <laughs> that whole rock thing? Is it a bird? <laughs> is it? Oh, you mean is it? Oh, the not legs? that. Oh, is it a, the legs the of right, a bird? The right. That, is it, uh, okay. The that legs whole of, pink it, rock in the background. It's, it's a roadrunner's legs, basically. Right. Yeah, I giant... see a print. I see a woman's face, but it's also <laughs> a bird. Go up up hold on look at that do you see that the I just, okay i, I think realize the giant wing, i see the wing i see that that's the wing of that thing in the front but then the top of the wing looks like that's the side view of an eye that's part of the face of this bird creature that's basically that whole pink sort of column in the background i kind of see what you're it saying it looks like I a think. weird ass bird thing with sharp teeth and stuff actually i don't know what you're talking about actually oh my god it's really intense <laughs> I swear. Wow. That looks weird. It's a bird in the background. Wait, what penis behind be, below the gold dragon's hand? Oh, oh, let's take a look. Get close up on that, please. Okay, that is definitely something. Yeah. By the way, Chicken Jessica, if you don't want it to just... Well, it doesn't matter, but if you don't want it to yeah, just I had make a... Yes, please. 
How do I oh, if you don't, that? this you 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 know how it did not a perfect circle just now or ovular shape. You can make it do what you want by selecting. Just do a right click on there, and, and it it will not do that. I mean, you can make it know, so mine, it doesn't lock. I think mine's different it, than yours. It doesn't. It doesn't no, no, I, mine does that too. But you just have to. It doesn't matter anyway. Yeah, then, then, uh, look at look at that penis though. That's a very good observation. Who who pointed that out? Was that uh, Chose or something like that? Oh no! Yeah. Okay. Good. Let's look at the penis. Yeah, that's that is definitely something suggestive. They did that on purpose, and they knew what they were doing. Don't you think, Laura? More than likely. Anyway, let's zoom I, out though, real quick. I think that this whole thing—they look like giant legs to a chicken or a roadrunner or something like that. Zoom out. Yeah. Can we zoom out? Danny says the dragon looks like Snoop Doggy Dog. So there's a straight up bird weird creature, and it's a profile view. The top of that wing is a freaking eye with a cheekbone. Okay, what, what's uh, which way is it looking? Is it looking to it's the left or the right? To the right, looking to the, our right. Okay, and, and it's got like it's very strange looking. Okay, but, okay, look at the top of that brown wing. Right, the top of it, mm -hmm. there's like a slanted eye. Kind I see of. the eye. I see the eye. Okay, and then the like white, the lighter part of the wing is like the cheekbone of the, uh -huh. the creature, and then just yeah. below that, in that rock column, the pink rock thing, there's a side view of an open mouth with really sharp teeth, like this, and it's like just looking to the right. It looks weird. It's like a weird ass bird. Oh, I I see it here. Zoom in on it, I guess, real quick. Weird ass bird monster up in there. I'm sorry, I'm only, I wasn't listening. <laughs> oh, just zoom in to the on the right corner, the bird, the bird man, bird creature. There's no, you don't know what the bird creature is. No, but it's up, 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 up to right the right. There. Okay, there it is. I see it. Yeah. Wow. It. No, up to the Go right. To the right, up and to oh, the right. Yeah, yeah, there. See that? The I eyes. See it. Like, yeah. And so the, the teeth, teeth, the teeth are, like, are opening, right? They're open, yeah, and it's like the mouth is open, and it's revealing like the teeth and the gums, kind of in the rocks. Uh -huh. yeah. Right. I see it. Yeah. That looks weird as hell. <laughs> all right, let's go next. Oh, do you I see guess. how it's like a bird monster type of thing? Uh, yeah, I totally see it, hundred uh, percent. Yeah. The way. There you go. See. Thank you. Good. <laughs> okay, Cammy's. Hold on. Hold on. Cho said, said Laura it. Laura isn't yeah. satisfied with a golden dragon. She has to find a different creature. Shake my head. <laughs> a gold right. Well, the dragon, I don't even that does is that a dragon? It's funny. I really see it now from a distance. I really see that. Bird yeah, it's really the there. Rock. It's hard for there. <laughs> or whatever. It's not even a bird creature. It's just something else. It's I some mean. kind of it's weird, a monster. It's just a monster. monster, but it has yeah, bird like a aspects. <laughs> Right. Another Dungeons and Dragons game. Sorry, you crashed again. <laughs> oh, that's all right. I mean, oh, are we maybe, maybe... Look at all of these or no, no. I mean, we just whatever. We can just go next, next, next. We can say that. You know, we're allowed to do that, you know. <laughs> okay. We could just go next, 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 you know. Mm -hmm. But um well, anyways, uh, you know, maybe we could next time. We'll just go back to looking at commercials. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't mind looking at box art for other stuff. I mean, it just, you know. What is know. your what's your concern about these games? That it's just kind of, you know, it is just right there. I don't know. It's just all going to be like here, graphic we'll just, art. Okay, well here, it's do you want to like, go next? I feel like live people are more fun to look at because there's uh -huh. just more sort of Well, you know, we got some live people There's some live people coming up soon, you know. Right. Are there? Next, yeah, next. One. Keep going. I'm there's a lot of these Dungeons and Dragons. Dragons. It's weird. I've never even heard of those games before. Those Dungeons Love and Dragons. Love that game. <laughs> do you want to look at that real quick? Okay, fine. Let's see. No, we don't have to. I mean, no, I mean, I'm down. Okay, look at that guy's not even in the game. Who? The guy in the front. This what do you mean the guy in the front? Cheetah print guy. But I never the main seen it. I never even seen him in my darn life. He's the main character. He's the one no, you control. It does not look like that. The He's one the who one I control, control is wearing shorts. I think that guy's wearing a cheetah outfit. <laughs> Titty out. Are, and his nipples are showing. Titty yeah, out. Titty is out. That's that's the main character. 
That Master is a man, and the person I play is a boy. Wow, look at that breast. Master Higgins. Oh, my God. Look at that. Zoom in on that breast. <laughs> or breasts. Dude, that is full on. I know. Face. That is kind of what? real breasty. I mean, that's oh a my full God. breast. That's a full, fully blown breast right there. And actually, it could be argued that that is, you know, an angry woman whose breast is out, and she's wearing her leopard print outfit. <laughs> And she's saying, don't look at my breast. It's well, out. She's, no, she's saying, get out of here. I'm cleaning the house. <laughs> I do not want anyone seeing this mess. She doesn't care about her breast. She's fine with it. <laughs> it's not the breast that she's yeah. telling people. <laughs> she's like, my rhino's going to have a conniption fit. Get out of here. <laughs> my rhino that's her rhino yeah like they're, they're like that rhino she's like my rhino is about to have a conniption fit if he knows i let any guests in in the house with the house looking like this get out of here it's like some reporters are at the door they want to do an interview i don't know some reporters want to do an interview they're like we heard your uh you know that you have a very fancy extravagant lifestyle with gold and riches and we would love to come take a look at your crib she's like get out of here my I'm crib cleaning. is a mess <laughs> my crib is an absolute fucking mess <laughs> okay please zoom uh, out for a second one second real quick it's interesting that this game has that kind of 80s looking grid kind of 3d grid thing on the bottom of it because that's more of a right, capcom like, type i mean thing. yeah that's well, also it's like where is that in the game that's nowhere <laughs> well yeah, it's just interesting that hudson had those designs anyway all right we can go next I, no, i've never seen a single one of those characters in the game by the way except maybe the snake guy <laughs> they're all in the game they they're aren't no the they don't look like that at all yeah they do look at that octopus is in the sea level you know where is the octopus on the cover? On the right. Oh. Wow, over one million sold in Japan. Look at, see, okay, there's the guy who you're playing up in the top, next to the eye. That's well, a, but a zoom, boy. Can you zoom in on that? But the per the mom wearing her cheetah print outfit in front is not in the game. Okay. Uh, who's in the He's game? Like, Stop! My son will not be going out until he's actually. Hold on, can you zoom in on Whoa, the breast? Whoa, there's of the a breast woman? person on the top right. Look at yeah, that. Let's, let's zoom in on the breast. Holy of the... shit! <laughs> what the hell? That is a woman with breasts. S zoom in on that more, actually. And she's like tied up or something. Oh my god, this is some bondage shit right here. <laughs> what I the know, hell is going on here? Trying to jump in, I never noticed it said Takahashi. Yeah, you know Takahashi is, is master. master Takahashi is, is master. Right? Yeah, that's Master Takahashi. He did that the extreme thing you know that they used to show on spike tv but i mean it was they dubbed it but um you know that guy you know he's an actor you know and he was in um you know uh merry christmas mr lawrence i think oh well you know look at my rest my case there's the boy that you play in the main game next to the eye on island see he's wearing like some shorts and he's on a skateboard that's the main dude where who is this cheetah print wearing person <laughs> what are you looking at Okay, in the title area on the green. Oh, oh that right there. That's you mean, the guy. Okay, right. Why is he wearing a cheetah print <laughs> kind of moo? -moo That's not you know? him. That's not him. That's his mom. Uh, you know what, Laura? You might have a point here. You know. <laughs> I think that's his mom. She's like, she's like, Bobby will not be going out today until he cleans up this mess. <laughs> like that house. That's his mess that he left. The whole. And she just room. wears this moo moo and doesn't care about right. her boobs coming out and stuff or oh, whatever. That's her normal house look, I think. So to yeah, Takahashi or whatever. That's yeah. The, the, it's just interesting because um, anyway, yeah. Anyway, carry on. Wait, why do they call it Hudson Soft? <laughs> why it should have been Hudson Hard? You think? Oh, why because it's supposed they... to be like software. Oh, okay. Whoa, <laughs> Adventure Island Two. Wait, go in on that. Yeah, that. I don't even. Oh, it's a nice illustration. That looks much more along the lines of what I would have expected. Oh, huh, is that, that for regular Nintendo? Yes. Well, that looks fun. Next. I, hey, I like that. I kind of I like this illustration, though. You know, I mean, anyway. This part, oh, is that for Nintendo part, as well? Right. Yeah. Oh, look, they got a little space, you know, UFO there now. I don't love that. Wow, he gained, he kind of, wow, his body really big. <laughs> he got bigger. I mean, and he, older. 
he definitely he's looks no different. He looks boy. older now. It's funny because he's he kind of gained some. His body changed a bit in yeah, the way that it's designed. Certainly not a boy anymore. Right, he's not a boy. All right, next. We'll just we'll finish on you know one coming up. <laughs> okay, I guess. <laughs> okay, let's just look at this for a second here. Okay, now this guy has an interesting face. Take a look. He kind of looks like Ted Danson meets. Go go deeper, or zoom in more. Who does he remind me of? That guy. Paul Hogan. Mm-hmm. No, he looks. Like, first of all, that head looks almost like a different head. Pay, right. you know, put well, on he has there, you no know? neck. There's no neck. <laughs> <laughs> right. Now, it's like Paul Bun- No, it's like, uh, what's that guy's name? Newman. Paul Newman. No. Who, Ted that, or who does that look like? It looks like somebody. His know. hands are gigantic. His hand is huge. Oh, my God. Right his there. hand is so huge. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think it kind of looks like Woody Harrelson mixed with Tommy Lee Jones or something. Oh, yeah. That's just me. Right, yeah, right, right. it's something. Somebody. It looks like somebody. And those hands are gigantic. Is elephant Titus of the hands and the head? Can you look at the people in the back real quick? The bad guy, I guess, and the girl. Dude, that girl is not in a good shape with that guy. Oh my god, she's like really being abused by that guy. <laughs> Jesus, uh-huh. that's violent. Look at it. He's grabbing her by the arm, and her breasts are like practically coming out. What's going on there? Is she like his? Some property or something? Well, it's that guy's girlfriend, the guy in the front. That's his girlfriend? The guy in the front's girlfriend, yeah. Oh, really? Oh, I thought she was like his prostitute. <laughs> the guy in you the mean back. the guy the guy in the back is a pimp or something? Yeah, or something. He's like uh-huh. Yeah, or something. You know, it does kind of look like Eric Roberts a little bit, you know. Look at that kind of shot. Oh wow, look at this New Or New Orleans shot. Look, King's S- Saloon, does that say? Mm-hmm. I thought it was going to say King's Salmon. Uh, go down to those shops real quick. All right, whatever. I mean, look at that the... knot on his rope on his belt. Oh, yeah, Jim Varney. That is... It looks, it Hold looks on. like that Ernest goes to the... what? That's suggestive. Oh, yeah, it looks like Ernest. It does look like Ernest. Yeah. Wait, look at his belt, though. That is some kind of penis meets butthole. <laughs> Don't you think? Look, at, look zoom in on that the knot. That is so intense looking. Zoom right? in on the knot. It's so bulbous. Everything about him is bulbous, as I say. <laughs> Look at that. That is so. That's a really interesting shot. That you know what would be kind of fun? Vulgar. You know what would be fun, actually, Chicken Jessica, is if you start didn't show it to zoomed in and see if we can guess what it is. You know, zoomed in. You know what I mean? That would be fun. Actually, you mean we'll do see it. if you can guess what it is. Yeah, yeah I mean, if not even right. No, 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 no. I'm not even saying guess the game. No, I'm saying guess what it is. So, for oh, example, in sure. this, we would say, "Oh, that's a crotch with, and it's a knot with, you know, or something like that." It's a, it's a knot in front of a crotch or something like that. You know what you I know mean? No, it looks like it looks like some kind of testicle with like a tumor in it or something. Look at those six packs. I mean, six pack. Look at the oh. six pack of of abs. I see a turtle. A sea turtle. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh Swimming. right 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 i sort of know what you mean um and look at how there's a scarf around his leg why is that there it is because his muscles are gonna rip out otherwise well i think what we should do is look at okay. how muscular his thighs are my god where the right, the right thigh above the tie look at those muscles in there oh yeah yeah right all right. Oh wait, well, look at his hand real quick. Is is the one on our right? Yeah. <laughs> Can you zoom in on that hand? That's suggestive. That's suggestive of pinching something. You know what I mean? Or like grabbing it, something. You know. It's just a muscular. It just or sticking it... the finger in something. You know, it's suggestive. Look at his pinky. It's so weird. Right. Like... The pinky is suggestive of something. Yeah. All right, next. Um. <laughs> That's just not working. It's like keeps crashing. I'm sorry. Uh, okay. You do. You're doing. We can great. wrap it up, and we could just yeah. We can play out of here. Uh, you know what? Sorry, Trout. 
Trout, and it's not just Trout. There's that, you know, MC. And you know, MC, uh, MC, you know. Or, wait, wait, not, no, sorry, not, not PB. Uh, what? It's Ultra Iwazaki or something like that. I mean, it was something like that. Izakawa, I think it was. MC Izawa. It could also be MC Izawa. Yeah, I mean, sure. Yeah. Well, no, I think it was Iwazawa or something like that. Izawa. Um. So look, um, <laughs> Bayou Will William, Bayou William, you get back home. You yeah, clean like, your no, room. No, no, no. It is what it is. <laughs> All right, oh, look. You're right. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to after show. D well, I, here's the thing. I wanted to get to anticipation, which we were close to getting to. You know. Why don't we just do only do that? All right, let's just look at anticipation real quick, and then we'll wrap it up. Value, you know. Wait, wait, I just, I'm sorry. All pro basketball real quick. Can I see that? Oh, yeah, that's just funny because it says, instead of New York Knicks, it says New York Slicks. And instead of L.A. Lakers, it, so, it says L.A. Breakers. Uh -huh. New York Slicks. Okay, go on. All right, let's just look at this real quick. Zoom in. We, didn't we already look at this last week? No, we didn't. Oh, we did. We did? Not well, really. We no, we didn't. The, um, we looked at the commercial for it. We didn't oh, go right, face by commercial. face, though. You know. Right. Oh my god. <laughs> she's what that actually kind of looks like uh, the head is just sort of photoshopped on in a way. But wow, hey, that is really you, interesting, man. That is interesting. She's what you call. Can you you can get rid of. You can get rid of the thumbnails on the on this. Yeah. Look they're at like, that. They're wow. like, give me intense. You were into this game. You are into this game. And she's like, right. how's this? And she's married too. To the dude on the right. Uh, the, uh, look at, let's look at that. Wow, this guy's face. Yeah. Man, these are really interesting. You know, it's a what a weird. I remember seeing this for the first time, and I thought well, it's interesting that there's a real photo of people on here. It's also right. just interesting that it's marketed towards adults. You know, right? Wow, what is their marriage like? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Party fun. Wow, Whoa. that is suggestive. The does, fact she that have, it says, does she have spit coming out of her mouth? I don't oh, my know. God. Yeah, right. You know what's funny? Wait, go zoom out just a little bit. For it to say party fun and show that mouth like that, that there's something up with that. You know what I mean? Well, we're also just zoomed in so intensely. Can we zoom in? Her, zoom her, in. Her, one. Her? Yes. That. Yeah, it's it almost it looks as if she's drooling. <laughs> drooling or something. Zoom out a little bit. Look. Oh. Party. Oh, no. Okay. Well, it's less. It, I, when it just said party and it was zoomed into the mouth, I mean, it was the mouth and it says party. There's something about that that looks it almost, almost looks porno. Like she's... Look, that looks like a porno, actually, almost, you know? Well, also, it looks like party. she's wearing Playboy mouse ears or bunny ears or something like that. That's a porno. Can't... Right. All right. Wait, now let's look at her full face. I mean, no, but keep keep it zoomed in though. Um, that's interesting. That is interesting. It kind of weird, actually. It reminds me of that game, Shrieks and Creeks. Okay, what's up? Let's move on to another person here. Wow, that guy's a real hunk in a way, you know, right? I mean, no hunk that I would ever necessarily go for, but because he looks like I this, mean, here, blow me up for a second. This is what he looks like. TV. This is what he looks like. <laughs> you know? He's got that kind of hunk look. <laughs> He's doing something with his tongue. He's like... Yeah. Right. Wow. Wow. She is very wide-eyed. <laughs> wow, she's really animated. Oh, my God, those eyes are so intense. Wow. <laughs> wow she's wow. doing a sort of a you Look know a that musical she's awesome. doing a musical thing she's going ah, you know the jazz hands thing you know she's, she's going really jazz, jazz hands i think that the director said i want to see some jazz hands not everybody but some of you she's like let me do it i want to do it <laughs> how's this 
Look at we got a young Drew Carey up top. <laughs> Drew Carey. Whoa, she looks like a runaway. Wow. Like she could have been, I don't know, a character. I bet you she was on the Howard Stern show later on in life <laughs> as a guest. Don't you think? I, mean, I don't know, I guess. She could have been. Look what at, was at, her look career? Gemma's, How did look her at Gemma's career? new picture. I saw it, yeah. Oh. Dude, what became of these people? What became of them? I know they should do a where are you now kind of thing now? on these people. The people you know? the I want to see what they look like, you know? Look at this Drew Carey over here. He's <laughs> not Drew Carey. He didn't look like Drew Carey. This was his early per career. This is what he did. Who knew that that guy would later become the host of The Price is Right? <laughs> <laughs> well, he's the only one who got lucky out of all these actors. All these people are what you call acting. They're like, I want to see big eyes, big eyes, everybody. <laughs> the director said, This guy's like, is like this? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, Is this okay? He's like holding his mouth in that position. All of them are doing big eyes except for the Howard Stern show guest. <laughs> Right, right. Well, what? no, the other, the hunk guy on the right is not doing big eyes. Oh, yeah, hunk guy is just like, I don't do big eyes. <laughs> He's like, that's a little too much for me. He was later seen as Cody on Step by Step. Hey, I just realized something. Oh, no, no, never mind, actually. I was, I thought it was uneven for a second, you know, but it, it, it it's even. All right. Well, anyway, that's that, you know? That's some box art stuff, I guess. Good. Here's what we're going to do on the next one. We're going to go... Um, what we're going to do when we do after-show debriefs, and as a member, Trout and MC Iwazaki... Or it's not... What, it, he was, what was it? Iwaza? Iwaza? Izawa. Izawa, I think it was. What we're going to do is we're going to... Look at, I guess, more box art, arts. Are we just staying with Nintendo games, or is there other systems too? Oh man! <laughs> I mean, that's all I got. I can, I'll, I can download. Oh, oh no, that's Nintendo. fine. That's fine. No, that's don't fine. download. If you're gonna download stuff, download yeah. some other live action stuff. Like no, but here's Marvel. what we do. Here's what we do. We'll, we'll do a game, okay, on the after show debris where just load up one and zoom in, and then we're gonna try to guess what the pick, what it is. You know what I mean? It might be kind of fun, I think, you know? Okay. <laughs> uh, Good. Izawa, by the way. Izawa. MC Izawa. So that's... And then, the, there, how do you become a member? You just basically go to... Um, you go. You, there's a join button on the bottom there. And <laughs> you just do that. You join. That's how you join. And then you basically... Um, you you can get these icons and you do these things you can, you know, you could use these different images that we hand drew and there's these badges too that we hand drew. And then also, um, see, that's what they look like. And also the tier two, by the way, if you're interested, some behind us, behind the scenes kind of content, you know, we usually have these kind of meetings that we do, the day before the show to talk about well, what, what do we want to do this week? And I don't know, we look at different things and joke around sometimes. And then we also, you know, have sometimes have some reviews and things and you get a monthly ringtone as well. Monthly ringtone. You get access to all the preceding ones. Um, you look at, if you want to, to look at all the past after show debriefs and stuff, it's just go to the playlist for the chicken coop on this channel. And also if you go to the community tab here on this channel, then you can, get all the previous um, other stuff that is not in the playlist. That's for the, the members. Okay. Um, so other than that, uh, we'll see you. Uh, thanks to everybody for tuning in. And we're here every Monday at 6 PM uh, Pacific time. And thank you to chicken Jessica for chicken Jessica's help. And um, just in a less than a minute, we're going to be over at the after show debriefs which is happening right now and it happens every week after the show for members only. And we're going to play a game, I guess. So my name is Brent Weinbach. I'm Laura Weinbach. And thank you for watching the chicken coop.